And hello, hello, this is Unkindest. In today's video, we're gonna have a look at new tanks which are coming in update 3.7 and it is M6A2E1 American heavy tanks. You can win them in the event which is coming in update 3.7. In today's video, we will quickly have a look at the stats and see some battles with it, how it can perform in the battlefield and what is the difference between them two. So essentially it's the same tank, the same hull, the same turret so it looks exactly the same on most parts you see the tracks the same the rear the same the only difference is from the front so on the tier 8 tanks the armor profile is a bit different frontal plate is sloped better but basically the same numbers uh, on we go to the numbers we see that tier 7 tank has 1300 hit points the armor profile in the hull is 191 millimeters from the front 44 from the sides and 41 from the rear and the same number uh, in the turret 191 89 on the sides and 208 in the back of the turret it means that the back of the turret is armored better than the front in terms of the gun it has a turret 105 millimeter gun basically it's the same gun as an uh, t29 american tank with penetration numbers 198 millimeters with standard ammunition and 245 millimeters with premium ammunition 310 hit points average per shot if we look at tier 8 tank essentially it is the same it has better hit points number according to the tier of course 1500 hit points exactly the same numbers of armor in the hull and in the turret numbers are exactly the same but because the plates are angled differently the effective armor is a bit different on the tier 8 tank if we have a look at the gun the gun is 120 millimeter tier 9 gun essentially the same gun as a t-34 american heavy tank the numbers in penetration are 248 with standard ammunition and 297 with apcr means almost 300 millimeters penetration in tier 8 that's just incredible and 400 hit points average per shot okay we have seen the numbers i think the numbers are boring and it's not interesting let's proceed to the battles and have a look how other tanks can see you on the battlefield so firstly we will have a look how tier 7 goose tank can see itself in a reticle as you can see it is red almost everywhere except the turret cheeks and lower plate with apcr the situation is much better so you can penetrate almost everywhere frontally in hull down position this tank is quite efficient as you can see the gun manlet is strong the hull is strong so you can bounce many many shots and bully the guys who are below you because the tank is high it means that it has quite big effective gun depression okay let's continue with the tier 8 tank how it can see itself and yeah, the same situation with the turret so you see the there are weak spots on the turret hull is very heavily armored HE shots can be placed on the sides and on the rear of this tank. One of the best light tanks, Type 62, can penetrate this tank almost everywhere with heat, with APs on the sides and on the rear.
Another interesting thing to see how it looks in the reticle of I-6, one of the most popular tier 8 heavy tanks. As you can see it's almost everywhere red except cheeks and under the turret and turret ring, which can be penetrated quite easily. The turret is quite bouncy considering the accuracy of I-6. And this is how the tank looks with heat. Heat can penetrate the hull frontally, but with RNG of course. Not 100% penetration. Another interesting thing to see is how this tank can be seen by Glacial 112. Glacial has quite weak penetration with standard ammunition, it's only 175, but it has quite strong heat rounds which can penetrate this goose tank almost everywhere. But if you use the weak spots of the M6A2E1 experimental, you can deal with it even with standard ammunition. The next tank will be Löwe. Let's see how the Löwe can deal with this tank. Löwe has a very good gun with quite high numbers of penetration. It can use the weak spots of this tank and as you can see with APCR the hull is grey. And the last tank we're gonna check is OBJ704 with the infamous BL-10 gun with the enormous amount of penetration and alpha strike. Well, as you can see this tank is quite easily penetrated by the standard ammunition and especially with gold it will be like a butter. I would like to thank Martin Dogger for helping me out with these replays. Okay, so thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, give me a thumbs up and don't keep it secret from your friends. Bye bye.